Hello, Internet. Hi. And today we are back on Blue Bomb's Mega Spaceship. Part 2, for that matter. And if you can see, there's a lot more add-ons to this thing than you saw it last time. So first off, we enter the bubble dome that is the cafeteria through a trap door. See defined by these blue and orange logos. With the virtual tables and the logos for the bedroom and blaster C. So Blue Bomb, what are your thoughts on this place? Virtual tables. Okay, I didn't really understand what you mean by virtual tables, but I'm assuming that means you love them because you built them. Over here is the bedroom that has a daylight sensor that turns this light on and just a bunch of beds and stuff. So what are your thoughts on this place, Blue Bomb? Well, I like the daylight sensor. Now, last but not least, my favorite part, besides the bubble dome of the extension, Blaster Cannon C, with its main theme being green. Flip the lever, which opens the door and blasts particles from the end rod. Press the button, it opens the door and does laser stuff. I'm not sure how this works, but what are your thoughts on Blaster Cannon C? The blasters. Yeah, so if you can see, not if, as you can see, Blaster Cannon C was designed differently with the blaster turrets because they have sideways chain blocks instead of grindstones on them and they are much shorter, compact, and clear. Also, the fact that it's made of dark prismarine just makes it look a little bit more cool. Blue Bomb's Mega Spaceship is actually done in Blue Bomb's world where he has a lot of crazy stuff going on down there. Anyways, thanks for watching Blue Bomb's Mega Spaceship Part 2. Not sure if we're done with it, but definitely gonna be more videos of the future, which made no sense. So, thank you all for watching. Bye, Internet!